Okay, so last night I put the sensor on the top shelf in the refrigerator and it's sensor one. You can see it's 40 degrees right now. And the sensor max uh, read that it went to 43 degrees last night, maximum. I didn't have the alarm on. So I pushed sensor, uh, alarm sensor one and turned it off just a little while ago, or turned it on just a little while ago. And it's 40.5 degrees right now. So um, I'm gonna see if it goes off. And that, that, this is showing we have a problem. Um, this is what the temperature is supposed to be, 33 degrees it says. 41. Minus, this, this is what we want, and that is not the actual temp. Actual temp. That is not the temperature. The freezer's correct, I've checked that. Okay, alarm's going off again. This time I have the sensor sitting on the top shelf in the, um, in the door. So I'm uh, 42 degrees. That's not good. So this thing's helping me uh, see that. We might need another refrigerator. So that sensor is right here, top shelf, and now I'm going to put it down here where the milk is. That'd be interesting. Second shelf. You can turn the alarm off. Can you see the light here? I have to can't hold the flashlight at the same time. But uh, so I can turn the alarm off and then wait for this to cool down if, if it does in fact cool down. So we'll check this. All right, so the next morning, and I noticed on uh, sensor number one, the refrigerator is, uh, well, it's just almost 38 degrees, but over on the, on the right side, the maximum temp temperature last night got to 39. So it's, it's, getting, it's getting close to that 40 degree mark. And uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and now move the, the sensor here. To, I'm going to start it here on the on the bottom shelf. Let's see what that does. Okay, so this is interesting. The alarm's going off on uh, alarm sensor one. See it blinking there? Because of the minimum uh, temperature. That's the first time that's happened. Um, it's thirty. It's, it's thirty-one degrees. Uh, where the lo uh, location that's the uh, sensor. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the alarm here. And remember, I, I told you I was gonna put it on the third shelf, so right here. So it's really super cold there. So what I've learned is my top shelf, well, I, I reset this earlier, so you know, you can't read the maximum now uh, and minimum uh, what it was earlier, but the top shelf was uh, the alarm was going off because it was 41 a little over 41 degrees no no it was 43 degrees overnight on the top shelf and it gets below freezing on the bottom shelf so we got problems with this fridge anyway i just wanted to share this with you okay the alarm's added again on sensor one i put the sensor on the top shelf in the refrigerator just to double check sure enough the alarm's going off it's 41 degrees um we need another refrigerator. It's freezing on the bottom and too warm on top, and I don't want to spend the money to fix it. So thanks to this little uh, wireless thermometer, we uh, uh, we learned that our refrigerator uh, has some major issues, and our food could be going bad, and we didn't even know it. If uh, you found this video helpful, useful, please share it. And, uh, and uh, if you liked it, go ahead and like it and, and subscribe. Uh, and check out the other video, the review I did on this. Uh, yeah, wow. This is this is blowing me away. All right, well, thanks for watching.